Hi friends, today we are making green pepper sauce, popularly known as Ayamashe sauce. It is also known as Ofada sauce. Some call it designer stew, while others call it green stew. This sauce originated from Ikenne in Ogun State, Nigeria. As a story goes, there is this woman who used to make it for her friends and travelers or something. So, people will always go to her to order for it. Her name was Ayamashe and so the stew was named after her. This is a story I heard, so I don't really know how far it's true. But if you want to learn how this delicious Ayamashe stew is made, keep watching and I will show you how. So we start by prepping our meat. For this recipe, we are using a medium-sized whole duck. You can use any protein of your choice. So we add our meat into a pot, we season with some salt, seasoning cube and then we come in with our spice blend made up of ginger garlic calabash nutmeg and white pepper please go ahead to season your proteins according to your preference so we add in enough water we stir a bit and then we cover and bring to a boil we cook till it's about 90 percent cooked and then we set aside it's green pepper sauce right so we need lots of green peppers we are supposed to add in green scotch bonnet peppers as well because this sauce is meant to be spicy but since my children can't tolerate heat i won't be adding that in feel free to add it in in yours so we go ahead to deseed our green peppers and after deseeding our peppers we proceed to blend we will be blending in a food processor because we have to blend without adding in water. But if you don't have a food processor, use a normal blender and then you pass it through a sieve to take out some of the water else you are going to fry it forever. So this is the texture we are going for. It has to be roughly blended. So we add our blended bell peppers into a bowl and then we set aside. Then we proceed to dice the onions. We equally set aside the onions and then we proceed to bleach our palm oil. Ensure that your kitchen is properly ventilated before you do this. So we add our palm oil into a pot. We cover and place on medium heat for 10 minutes. After that, we let it cool down before we open up the pot. Let us proceed to make a Yamashe sauce. So into our pot, we transfer our bleach palm oil and then we proceed to fry the meat we fry it till golden brown and then we set aside then we add the blended green peppers directly into the hot oil the oil has to be hot to enhance its flavors we stir for about 30 seconds and then we come in with our diced onions. And we immediately add in the most important spice for this recipe. Fermented locust beans, locally called iru o dawadawa. Then we stir everything to combine and we leave it to fry for about 8 to 10 minutes or till you start seeing the oil floating on top just like this. And once it's well fried, we season with some salt and seasoning cubes. Then we add in about two tablespoons of blended crayfish. We stir everything to combine well. And lastly, we add in our fried meat. The sauce is a bit thick, so I go in with a little bit of meat stock. Guys, it is a tradition to add in boiled eggs 
in ayamashi sauce and we just have to stick to that tradition so we add in our hard boiled eggs and then we gently stir everything to combine and we allow everything to simmer on low heat for about three minutes and our delicious ayamashi sauce is ready guys you need to perceive the aroma in my kitchen at this point the flavors are out of this world you can choose to complement this sauce with whatsoever you like but traditionally this sauce is taken with ofada rice a local rice brand in nigeria let us serve and enjoy guys don't you think this sauce deserves a thumbs up please hit that like button below to support this video thank you if it's your first time stopping by here, you are most welcome. Hit the subscribe button to join this beautiful family. And to my returning subscribers, mm, mm, thumbs up for you all. Let us have a taste. Mm. Guys, this sauce is so, so sweet. In fact, sweet is an understatement. Give this sauce a try and I assure you, you will keep preparing it every day if you have watched up to this point i want to take this time to appreciate you thank you so much stay blessed and i will see you in my next video bye bye